Let's send things back to TJ in the studio for a look at your weekend forecast. TJ? Thanks, Kristen. Looking pretty good. We're looking at sunshine down there in westerly now. A little bit of cloudiness in other areas. We're drying out. Let's get a look at the forecast for Spring Fest down there in westerly. The rest of the day, well, the showers are gone. Looking at sunshine. We'll top out in the upper 50s. Next couple of days, upper 50s. There might be a shower on Sunday, Mother's Day, but I think most of the upcoming weekend will be dry. It's not, certainly not looking at a warm weekend. We'll be in the 50s. Rain showers have been around all morning are slowly moving away and now we're drying out clouds breaking apart. Here's a look at Narragansett. We've got some sunshine here. Peaks of blue sky. Look at Newport. A lot more in the way of blue sky here. But you can make out there are a lot of clouds still hanging around. 46 degrees. Wind from the northeast, 8 miles an hour. Picking up just a little bit. And we're looking at winds 10, 20 miles an hour as we go through the day. And those winds will ensure us to have kind of a, a cool day here in southern New England. But not all that bad as long as we've got that sunshine. It's 44 in Coventry, 46 in Newport, over in New Bedford, 48. So we've got a couple areas of low pressure that we're tracking that kind of hanging out along this front and they're going to be kind of working their way on off to our south and taking with them the rain. Let's take a look how it plays out hour by hour right through the weekend. This is nine o'clock this morning. So a few minutes from now clouds mixing with sun. We're all dry. We're dry through the afternoon with a blend of clouds and sunshine. Northeasterly winds keeping things cool. Now tonight our winds become maybe a tad bit more north and we're looking at some drier air to work its way in. That's good because if we get a little clearing after midnight, we might be able to see the northern lights. Look to the north and uh, let, give your eyes some time to adjust and you might be able to make out the Aurora Borealis. It would be kind of cool to see. We are looking at the clouds to kind of fill in through the day tomorrow, but we're staying dry. And as we go into Sunday, yeah, notice more in the way of clouds. Uh, there could be a spot shower or two kind of um, moving around, but I think for the most part, Mother's Day will end up dry this morning. We're looking at the showers ending. Clouds are breaking apart uh, mid 50s by noontime. Let's pinpoint the afternoon down in westerly upper 50s today. Narragansett 58 Newport in the upper 50s. Wickford should top out around 59 degrees up around uh, 60 degrees with a little bit more sunshine in Woonsocket and situate in the Providence area 59 in Fall River, but Alabaro you may sneak up to 60 this afternoon. Now for tonight, there could be a shower down near the south coast early this evening and then skies partially clear. Yet northern lights possibly visible after midnight and early tomorrow morning. Here's your seven day forecast. Blend of clouds and sun for Saturday. Rain chances are pretty low overall through the day between zero and 10 percent. Temperatures will top out in the upper 50s tomorrow. On Sunday, Mother's Day, we're looking at the possibility of a shower, but most of the day should end up dry with highs in the upper 50s. I think it will be cloudier on Sunday, but of course, Monday and Tuesday, bright and sunny and warmer, 65 to 70. WPRI.com, the Pinpoint Weather 12 app. The weather team will keep you updated through the weekend. Here's Melissa. One last check of your morning commute.